Good afternoon. I'm Jay Flowers, Director of Communications for Grace to You, and it's my privilege today to introduce to you our next speaker, Colonel Jeffrey Williams. Grace to You first came to know Jeff in 1999. In the early days of email, we received the following message sent to the ministry's general email address. Dear John, we get a lot of Dear John letters at Grace to You. <laughs> very, very sad. <laughs> Dear John, I have long intended to write, but it has taken years to do so. I've been a Grace to You listener since 1987 after discovering your radio program on a local Christian radio station. That was KHCB in Houston. I have two purposes in writing. The first is to briefly extend my thanks, and the second is to make a special request. I became a Christian in 1987. Although at the time I was very successful by the world's standards, things were in shambles both personally and spiritually. Although I won't go into details now, it was then that God extended His grace to my wife, Anna Marie, and me, and we came to Christ. Thankfully, from the beginning, I was inclined to test everything I heard against God's Word. Your teaching was especially challenging and motivated me to search the Scriptures to see if it was so. I thank you for the integrity of your teaching and your faithfulness to God's Word. To a large extent, it has been your teaching and ministry that has prepared me to teach and minister to God's people as a layperson wherever God has sent us. For that, I extend my heartfelt gratitude. Now for my request. By the providence of God, I am currently training on the crew of the Space Shuttle Atlantis. We are scheduled to launch from Kennedy Space Center in support of the new International Space Station. NASA allows crew members to carry a limited number of personal items during the flight. I would be honored if I could fly a memento for the Grace to You staff. Flying a copy of the MacArthur Study Bible may be the best option, literally taking God's Word around the globe as a symbol of what the radio ministry is already doing. Hopefully you find my request appropriate. I only wish to extend my gratitude, acknowledge the work of those at Grace to You, and glorify God in the process. In His service, Jeff Williams. I don't know what your policy is, but when an astronaut offers to fly something for me on the space shuttle, <laughs> I, I always say yes. So in the early morning hours in the spring of 2000, Jeff embarked on his first space flight in what was described then as the most spectacular shuttle launch in its history. With Jeff launched a copy of the MacArthur Study Bible and a personal relationship with Grace to You that has deepened and widened significantly in the decades since. In his two subsequent flights to the International Space Station, Jeff again took Grace to You along with him, flying mementos for the staff conducting live video conferences with us and making several long, 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 long distance phone calls <laughs> to our offices. After returning to Earth, he was featured on Grace to You Radio in an interview with John MacArthur. He has spoken at several conferences, including one here at Grace Church. Most recently, the focus of his presentations has been photography from his 2006 mission. During that six-month flight, he took an astounding number of photographs of the Earth, more than any astronaut in history. The best of the best became the foundation for the compelling presentation you're about to experience. Please welcome Colonel Jeffrey Williams. Thank you, Jim. Thank you, Jay, for that, uh, that introduction. 